The Lazzarini Design Studio revealed, Saudi Arabia's $5 billion turtle-shaped floating city. The superyacht, titled Pangios, will be capable of hosting up to 60,000 guests and will also feature malls and beach clubs. Saudi Arabia will soon be home to a $5 billion Terra yacht titled Pangios. The new project is shaped like a turtle and will accommodate up to 60,000 people. On completion, Pangios will become the largest floating structure ever built. Proposed and designed by Italian design studio Lazzarini, Pangios takes its name from Pangaea, the supercontinent that existed millions of years ago during the late Paleozoic and early Mesozoic eras. Pangios extends its length for 550 meters and measures 610 meters at its widest point, the wings. The floating yacht will see 19 villas and 64 apartments on each wing of the turtle-shaped Terra yacht. While the interiors of Pangios are yet to be revealed, Lazzarini expects $8 billion to be invested in construction, with a timeline of eight years. Pangios will also be comprised of nine different bows, which are further divided into several blocks. The bows begin from the entrance of the port area to the main square, that extends into a wide terraced villa and subsequently leads to private houses, buildings, and rooftop terraces, with an upper shell zone that offers the landing of various flying vehicles. In the lower space, the design team houses 30,000 cells or cluster compartments and provides an unsinkable floating solution for the basement which is conceived to be realized mainly in steel. Pangios will feature a rooftop garden, mall, and a beach club and a, providing direct access to the sea. While it is proposed for Saudi Arabia, Pangios is designed to sail around the world non-stop, as it will be equipped with virtually endless green energy supplies. Powered by nine HTS engines of 16,800 HP each, Pangios is expected to cruise at a maximum speed of 5 knots, 5.7 miles per hour per 9.2 kilometers per hour, drawing its power from ocean waves and the solar panels covered roof. In addition, the virtual spaces of the watercraft can also be purchased under an NFT collection. Adding that users will be to collect certain content and access in the virtual properties with their credentials. The same credentials will also work as a property deposit in case of a real construction, the design studio said.